Hello everyone, thank you for joining us. My name is Kai, I'll be taking you on this renovation tour that we're about to go on. A lot of things have been happening at the Bodhi and we're happy to be able to share them with you. First thing you'll notice are new roofs on the motel building, the apartment building, as well as a new roof on the Sutra Hall. Um, Maybe you don't know, but a huge windstorm about eight months ago tore the Sutra Hall roof off and now it has finally been completely replaced. Thankful for that. Uh, the motel rooms, all four of them, have been completely renovated. Um, They're absolutely beautiful now. Um, they have new bathrooms as well, a new tile floor in there, new fixtures, beautiful new showers. Uh, they're absolutely amazing. Out back, we uh, replaced our hot water well and redug it so it's much easier to access if we have any difficulty with it now, um, saving us a lot of time. Here in the back, we freed up a lot of space, and then this is going to be used for potential student housing in the future. Uh, the apartment building has new stucco, new windows, and it has been divided into two apartments. Uh, one will be Dane and Roshi's, who we are expecting to arrive very shortly. He'll be living with us for the foreseeable future. In the back here, this is the back of the Zendo, uh, we freed up a lot of space here as well. There was a huge dirt pile here uh, from when the Sutra Hall was constructed almost 20 years ago. Um, this new space is going to be used for uh, potentially a new zendo, kind of a monastic area, a place of silence and meditation. Um, we also have a yurt that was donated, so we may possibly set up the yurt somewhere back here. Right now it's just a great place to sit and listen to the river. Um, but a lot of possibility for this new space and we're excited to see what we can do with it. Uh, this is the terrace uh, connected to the Zendo porch. Um, this is a great hangout spot. Uh, the staff likes to sit here and chat or we'll have meetings here, sit here and read a book. Um, it's just a beautiful spot in the summertime and a beautiful place to just watch the hummingbirds as well. Hey fella! Uh, coming down to the hot springs, these are our new Peking ducks, Bubba and Steve. They're super adorable. Um, the cold pond was dug out and we're hoping to get some new lotus flowers in there. Um, we've also been storing water in it and using that cold pond water to uh, water the gardens. The river has been trimmed up and cleaned. Great place to take a cold plunge. Uh, the lower pool was unusable for many years, but it's totally cleaned out and beautiful, as are all of our other hot springs, which are toasty and waiting for you. The coyote fence is absolutely new. It's a mixture of the old style with new. It's, it's wonderful. Um, we're so happy to get that done. We still have about 20 chickens or so who are laying fresh eggs for us every day um, and they help us by eating our compost and leftovers. Uh, we have a new gardener and she's been helping with a lot of things, one of them being uh, tightening up our composting systems as you can see here. Uh, all of the gardens this year have just been amazing, they're all in full bloom. The sunflowers are as beautiful as ever as you can see. Uh, those Bodhi sunflowers. Uh, in the gardens we have a lot of delicious things, peppers, um, some delicious green chilies as you see here. Uh, we've been growing a lot of greens as well, some delicious squash, uh, kale and chard. We have a beautiful um, field here. This is blue corn. Some of our friends from the Jemez Pueblo came up and helped us plant all this so we're excited to see that in the fall luscious tomatoes. I mean, you can see we got a lot of beautiful, beautiful produce. Um, chilies of all sorts, uh, eggplants. Uh, this basil is so fragrant. I wish you could smell that right now. It's so, so delicious. Um, purple bell peppers. It's, it's just been great. Um, we want to take this time to just say thank you to everyone for your continued support. And uh, thank you for coming on the tour with me. And if you don't know, this is Jade. She's the new Bodhi mascot. Hey, Jay. Thank you so much.